We have an ELP open house. Parents and family members, guests, other teachers from around the building come and they can kind of show off their work, answer questions about their research and have an opportunity to present what they've been doing in class in a, in a different way than just to their peers. Every year in ELP we do a different project. Last year we chose one specific person and did this whole thing on them. We had to dress up like them and give a speech as them. And then sixth grade we chose a certain topic that we liked and went on through that. Students are working on their independent research projects. There's a different project that each of the 6th, 7th, and 8th graders are doing. The 8th graders are doing a project called uh, Guess Who's Coming to Dinner, where they plan a fictitious dinner party for themselves and 11 guests uh, from any field of study. Some of them have chose to uh, pick a specific uh, theme. Some of them have picked uh, individuals from all different uh, walks of life and they're kind of planning and preparing their dinner project. What would they serve their guests? Where would they hold this party? And why they are creating a mock um, press release for their event. And then they're writing a script of potential dialogue that their uh, characters might say to each other at this dinner party. Hands-on opportunity of researching, uh, planning and preparing a project, and then presenting their material in a different way. With the menu, we have to find a recipe and make it. Each one of us is going to have a little piece of our dinner that we're all going to pretty much go around and eat everybody else's food. My favorite part has to be planning what's going to happen throughout the night. I'm inviting all authors and actors, and they're going to dress up like their characters, and they're going to stay in character throughout the night. So. It's just a lot of fun to plan what they're going to do, kind of put yourself in their place. kind of gives you the idea of write, what writing a thorough research paper would be like in college and citing your sources. Besides just the researching, the time management of planning, preparing a project like this, they kind of get to make their own decisions about their learning and how they do that. I think that's the, the best thing that they get out of the project is that.